So this is how you make the Black Sican Mex Soul Sunrise Sandwich. Let's pre-slice these uh, green tomatoes. We're gonna put them in some seasoned flour that I made using my own house seasoning. Make sure we cover that up really good. We're gonna dip that into an egg wash and then right into a cornmeal breadcrumb mixture that I made as well. Make sure that it's coated really well so that when we fry it, we get a nice little crust on it. Now that you got your tomatoes all coated up nicely and battered, you're gonna place them in a fry bag. Not gonna put too many in at one time because I don't want them to stick together. Okay, so you're probably wondering what that red stuff is on the sandwich if you looked at the picture online. What that is, is actually smoked salmon. So it already comes pre-sliced and all you do is group it up, place, place it in your fry basket loosely. You get a shot of that in there. Not too much, about a half a cup two sandwiches. We're going to fry that up. About a minute or so we'll do it. And that's it. Salmon bacon. Okay, almost finished. We got our tomatoes done. We got our salmon bacon done. What we're doing now is we're toasting on the grill. I like to toast my Thomas's English muffin on the grill. Once those are golden brown, you can go ahead and remove those then we're gonna go on and start cooking our egg. Eggs are frying up there. I'm gonna go ahead and get started on the avocados. Now you wanna make sure your avocado are soft to the squeeze. Let's see if we got a good one here. Ah, that's beautiful right there. Yep. Okay, our eggs are finished. We're gonna go ahead and put those on. Now, we've been lucky to get the sandwich size Thomas's English muffins. They're really good, so I can put two eggs on each one of my sandwiches. But if you're using the regular size ones, you just wanna reduce that down to one egg so it'll fit. We got our eggs on. We're gonna place our fried green tomato on top of our eggs. Gonna put a couple of strips of salmon bacon on there. Then I freshly sliced avocado. Place those on there. Like so. Now you can use, I'm using a southern pepper jelly. You can use any kind of pepper jelly you want. You want to use something that got some peppers in it so to give a little bit of spice to it. And there you go, folks. There's your Blacksican Mexo Sunrise. Appreciate you guys voting for us. Hopefully we'll see you in the winter circle. If not, enjoy some good food at least.